Greetings to you all in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Uh God has great plans for you and me. Divina Misericordia Ministry is a ministry started by Heavenly Father. What we do in this ministry we are praying for nation. We are praying by reciting Divine Mercy Chaplet for nations asking and crying out for lord's mercy to downpour upon our lives our country on the nations of the world right now as we are battling the covid-19 people are going through a midst of sufferings we are decided to pray for the designated nations god has allocated for us so it's not man has started this ministry holy spirit did i would love to explain about some of the initial stages and how this ministry has been progressing under the guidance of the holy spirit in the year 2019 brother saju kletus was praying in an adoration chapel in india god inspired by the holy spirit to start this ministry he got in, he he was inspired by the holy spirit to pray for nations so uh, he had few friends in the middle east they all came all together and decided to uh, form a whatsapp group brother saju had initiated that thing and and around 63 people had joined in that whatsapp group i was one of those uh, 63 people and i got russia to pray for and many others got different nations assigned for them to pray for and we all were praying divine mercy chaplet so it was it began in a small group of 63 people praying for 63 nations under the guidance of the holy spirit later on people from the various sectors and various parts of the world started join as we couldn't contain people in one group it went from 1 to 2 to 3 to 5 and my dear brothers and sisters we have reached in a level where people from almost 46 48 nations and five continents over 25000 people have signed up have joined in this miraculous procession that has started by the holy spirit i would love to call it as a miraculous procession because no one would have ever thought that this would be become so big like what it is right now people from africa in the united states australia india different asian countries various african countries have come together under the umbrella of divine mercy chaplet reciting and praying for nations along with that we have started zoom gatherings in indian languages as well as in english and people are are attending those gatherings are getting really blessed delivered from a lot of issues in their life god is attesting those meetings with his beautiful presence signs wonders his healing presence miracles are flowing mother mary's glorious presence have been a, a, an inevitable part in those meetings and people are becoming more and more closer to mother mary those who have been have having been reciting rosaries have started to recite rosaries and they are experiencing a supernatural level of god's glory like never before in their life blessed be the name of the lord what a glorious god we serve my dear brothers and sisters if you are part of this mission it is not by man it's not by might or power it is through the power of the holy spirit not by our own strength or our own power it works it is working under the guidance of the holy spirit and through the perpetual intercession of mother mary right now we are moving uh, in the catholic church as a ministry under catholic church uh, blessed by the reverend bishop bishop reverend dr vargis chakalakal and bishop anthony charayat uh, is our patron we have two we have a patron bishop Uh, Reverend Dr. Vargis Chakalakal and our spiritual director uh, Bishop uh, Reverend Dr. Anthony Chariot so we are blessed with the presence of bishops and we have thousands of priests and uh, nuns who have we have different groups of exclusively for catholic priests and nuns and there are there are almost 155 groups or far above than that these days because many many groups are adding on a daily basis people from various parts of the world are joining in this mission so you are in this mission 
because God has strategically placed you in this mission for a great purpose in such a season as the world is going through sufferings our responsibility is to pray for nations and cry out for mercy before the second coming of our Lord Jesus Christ God is preparing the world and people through prayer and right now he is using you and me in this mission so God bless you may you be used mightily in Divina Misericordia ministry in your country if you haven't started your ministry uh, Divine Mercy Divina Misericordia uh, group in your church I invite you please don't hesitate uh, to start a group in your own church in your own region it will be a great blessing because this group is heavily anointed by God and the presence of Mother Mary and the martyrs and saints are so rich in it the other day we were praying and we could we got a vision in which uh, Saint Vincent Ferrer is praying for this group as you all know that Saint Vincent Ferrer is known as the Saint of Apocalypse which means what you when you look into the world the incidents that is happening in the world is pointing out at the time where you can expect you can possibly expect the second coming we don't know when it is only heavenly father knows that but all the signs in the world is making us to eagerly anticipate for the return of our lord jesus christ christ so let's pray together dear lord heavenly father thanking you for this wonderful time i'm lifting my brothers and sisters who are from different parts of the world especially those who are watching me in the europe in africa in america in australia in asian countries let there be a, a, a divine intervention of you in their families today and in their lives today that that they will be able to sense your presence like never before that they will come to an understanding that god is not away from them god is nearer to them may the presence of saint faustina encompasses them and touches them may your glorious love fills our life oh lord we give you glory praise and honor in jesus name we pray amen hail mary full of grace the lord is with thee blessed art thou among the women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb jesus holy mary mother of god pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death amen in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit amen have a good day god bless you